Oh my gosh. I am such a mess right now. Um, anyways, I feel like I haven't uploaded to YouTube in like forever, and that's all simply because I haven't really had a lot of time to edit my videos. And I've filmed a couple, and I'm just not really satisfied with all the ones I filmed, but that's okay. Because, I don't know. Anyways, these past few weeks, I've really been thinking about my art journey and kind of where I want to be. I mean, I feel like this actually this whole past year, I've been thinking about it. And it's only five months in. <laughs> or almost six months in. Wow, it's already almost nearing the end of May. But I've, I kind of came to the realization of something, and that is I am too afraid to make good art. And what I mean by that is because I've never really had any formal lessons, I feel like I'm able to get away with saying, oh, I don't know what I'm doing with art. Uh, and using that as an excuse when my art isn't good enough or I don't like it enough. Right? So I'm really on this kind of self journey right now of improving myself and getting better at what I love right so uh, I'm trying to not be so afraid of just making art you know I'm usually I kind of fall back onto my buffers or I fall back onto doing artwork that I'm not proud of or just something quick just to have a picture right but I want to get better and I want to improve and I want my art to be the best that it can be. So I've actually kind of been deciding like, you know, going back and taking some art classes, which I never really had in my life because I never had the opportunity. I, when I started kind of thinking about my career, I never thought about wanting to be an artist. I didn't think it was even viable or possible. And ever since, like, I got into, like, watching YouTube and things like that, and I was like, oh my gosh, this this could be a possibility. I don't want to make it a career. I actually love the career I have right now. So I have no intentions of making art a career. I just want to be able to make better art and maybe to eventually kind of have it as a side business. But in order to do that, I need to improve. I need to get better. So, like I said, I've been thinking about taking art classes so that I can get better. Um, I've only ever had really two art classes in my life. One was in sixth grade when I was 12. And, you know, what do you learn when you're 12, right? Like, what do I even remember at the age of 12? Like, really nothing. The other class I had was in my freshman year of high school. So, during that time, the our teacher didn't really teach us much about art. I mean, there was some stuff, but it wasn't like, oh, wow, I really benefited from this class. No, it was just, you know, here, draw this picture or draw this idea. That was about it. The only thing I remember is her telling us to do a self-portrait and everybody else just messing around while I actually focused on the self-portrait and doing it the best I could. But... Those were the only two art classes I've ever had in my life, and it's is it a wonder why I'm not satisfied with my artwork? Because I've never had the opportunity to learn how to be a good artist. You know, and I know there's like resources out there, like YouTube's such a great resource, and there's so many other places or many other online resources, but I feel like I need the classroom setting to kind of talk things through and to figure it out, right? But that's kind of where my my journey is taking me right now, and I'm hoping to get into an art class soon. It's probably, I'll probably be one of those community ones, which will be great because I do work a full-time job, right? Preferably a weekend community one because <laughs> that's what I need. But I, I don't want to be afraid of making art anymore. I want to make art that I genuinely love and that I can feel proud of. And 
I would definitely say this painting is one of the ones I really do feel proud of. It definitely can get better. I do feel like I could have done a better job on some of the stuff that I did. But I am proud of myself. And this one actually took time to do. And I put more effort into it. And I want to... I want to do that with all the pictures I do. I want to feel that confident with all the paintings that I do. Um, so I feel like, you know what, I need to uh, advance myself and to go more into uh, learning about how to do art. I'm kind of trying to push myself back into doing basics so that I never learned. I mean, I only recently learned what gesture drawing was and why it was so beneficial. So <laughs> that's how bad my art education was. But I'm I'm kind of kind of excited to really start this art journey, and I've decided you know wherever this takes me, I might make some YouTube videos. I might not make a lot, but we'll see. But we'll see. Anyways, I also wanted to talk a little bit about um, somewhere where I kind of messed up with this painting, and that was when I was trying to do the gold leaf. I had just recently purchased some gold leaf, and I was really excited to test it out and it didn't go the way I was hoping it would. It, um, I messed up a lot on it and it was really disappointing, but at the same time, you know, it is what it is. All right. Uh, I, I still like the painting a lot after the gold leaf was put on. I do think it gave it a different vibe. I just wish I had done the gold leaf a little bit better. But, you know, I now it's a lesson that I learned for next time. Um, one of the reasons why it didn't go out well was because I was too worried about messing it up. So, uh, in the end, I actually ended up messing it up. Right? But, um, I don't, I, at the end of the day, I don't think it ruined the painting at all. One of the things that I did also try using was liquid gold leaf and... I didn't have the right colors that I wanted, so it contrasted too much with the globe and didn't come out that well. Anyways, um, I said I really hope you like this speed drawing and this kind of discussion. I, I swear YouTube has just become like a video diary for me to discuss my thoughts. Um, anyways, if you like it, please like and subscribe. Um, really, tr like I said, I'm really trying to improve and trying to get better, and it, it would really help if I could maybe get feedback on what I'm, what I could do. Because one of the things that I'm really, like I said, really trying is learning how to do YouTube better, and I'm realizing how much I suck at editing videos. So one of the things I'm trying to do there is learn that. But I hope everyone was able to just enjoy watching this and you know let's not be afraid to do art I think that's the most important thing that I'm trying to get out of my journey is not being afraid you know anyways take care have a great day or week or year or whatever just make it work for you and I wish you all the best